Hello everyone and welcome to Fun Electronics Today. In this video I want to show you how to manually solder SMD components. This is the method I personally use every day in my work and I wanted to share it with you. In this video I choose to demonstrate by soldering some 0805 sized SMD capacitors but it works in the same way for other size components. I usually solder one of the ends while holding the part in position with the tweezers. Then I flip the board around and solder the other end. For this I must first apply some solder on one of the pads. I usually apply solder to the right one because I am a right handed person but you can adapt it for yourself. In this demonstration I am going to use multiple tips and simple 0.7mm resin core solder wire. The soldering wire I am using is standard 6040 alloy. After I solder one of the pads of the component, I move on to the next one. Just make sure you apply enough solder material to it. Otherwise, the final soldering point will be too dry, oxidized and brittle. With enough fresh tin applied to the pad, you should be able to obtain the shiny metallic spherical mirror aspect. I then wipe out the excess. Just make sure you hit the solder long enough for it to melt properly and make good contact. I usually keep my soldering stations between 390 and 410 Celsius for this operation and I recommend these settings. As long as you don't have thermal sensitive components like LEDs which require a special temperature soldering profile, you should be safe from overheating them. In the following scenes I will solder the same component using different tip thicknesses but applying the same technique so you can see how it goes. So it doesn't really matter what kind of tip or soldering station you use, just make sure that the tip is clean and you use enough fresh tin to apply to the surface. Mm -hmm. 